Hello once again, this is Mr. HTE Hand Tune Engines. I wanted to talk about modification. Today we have a, a LRP 28 piston sleeve head. Alright. Modifying the sleeve. See this sleeve right here? Things not to do when you call yourself modifying or altering, what have you, man. One thing, thumb and rule, this coming from me. You heard it here first. Don't polish the sleeve. Okay? Don't polish the sleeve. This from me to you. I'm, I'm, I'm going to give it to your blood raw. You know what I'm saying? The reason why I say don't polish the sleeve because <coughs> you don't polish the sleeve. Do you see anybody on TV polishing sleeves or on, on these companies? Do you see them polishing sleeves? You got two things when it comes to metal. A, a metal and product. Okay? You have what they call a mill finish and you have raw material. You hear what I'm saying? When you see them pictures on them on them company sites and the sleeve be all shiny, it's not because they polished the sleeve, sir or ma'am. It's because it's a mill finish. It's either got a jet, it's been jetted, it, it, it's been water has to be used to keep it cool while it's going through its process or the Dremel or, or the CNC. Whatever they using at the time, that's what brings the shine on the metal. That would make this make it look all good and pretty and shiny. This ain't pretty and shiny. This because it's been used. It's been heated. It's been through a heat cycle, heat range. That's the difference. You got a mill finish and you got a finished product. You hear what I'm saying? Raw metal, some of it look like this. Dull, and some of it looks shiny as hell. And a lot of times when it looks shiny, it be a water finish. You know what I'm saying? But do not polish the sleeve. Because what will tend to happen, you will notice shit just slide and pop right out the block. The resistance will get minimal. You ain't got no tight when it go in and it just come out. Some sleeves, you, you can put a little... Your little wedge to pop out the, out the sleeve, it just come out. You, you damn near could stick your finger in there and stick your finger in the sleeve and pull it right out the block. You feel what I'm saying? Stick your finger in the sleeve, pull it right out. You know what I'm talking about. Stick your finger in there and pull it right out the block. Don't polish the sleeve, man. Let me put you up on game. That's a finished product. That's not a polished sleeve. It's a finished product. So don't, 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 all you models and modifiers or who don't know what you're doing, man, step your game up. HTE Engines, I'm coming. You hear what I'm saying? I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm going a, I'm to a, I'm a be the leader. I'm going to try my best to be leading in this RC, in this RC game. I'm trying to cross some of these T's and dot some of these I's, and when I get right, Y'all better look out for me. Rossi, LRP, one more out there. I love the death. And that's Thunder Tiger. Nickname Thunder Chicken. You hear what I'm saying? Um uh, I got some I got some fire over there now. I got a, I got a motor y'all won't probably never see that I got together. You understand what I'm saying? The new LRP. One of these days, I'm going to give you a sneak peek of the exclusive. You know what I'm saying? But on some real deal, all you martyrs out there taking people money, talking about polishing buff, stretching buff, stretching sniff, cut it out, man. Don't polish the sleeve no more. You understand what I'm saying? It, it don't serve no purpose. If you want to do something, polish the inside of the sleeve where the piston go at and help that out a little bit. But the the outside don't do nothing but sit in the block. It's 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 not polished. It's a finished product. It's either a finished product or it's a meal. It's meal. You hear what I'm saying? So so stop flossing.
and, and educate yourself on nitro engines. You hear what I'm saying? Y'all holler at me companies, CEOs or who have you. You know what I'm saying? I'm ready for business. When when you ready, I'm ready. You know, I don't I don't I, I can't demonstrate how I do some things on camera. Um I was advised by a patent at the patent office right here in, in, in the DC area. How I was advised when I asked the question, I was told how can you patent something that's already for sale? So you keep that in mind. Keep that in mind. I'm going to share that with you. How can you patent something that's already for sale? So if you selling something, and it's it, it just everybody probably doing it. You know what I'm saying? But me, I'm trying to do this thing right. I'm not trying to put something out there. Where everybody can grab on to it. You know, I'm really trying to really say what I got for the best. You know what I mean? There's a few guys out there who seen. I can tell when I look look at some of these videos and some of these some of these altars and some my. Uh, I see some of the similarities of some I done because a few pictures done leaked on on uh, on um on the internet. You know what I'm saying? And I say leak because under your name, certain things that you list your name under. If you like your camera phone, um, stuff like that, when you take photos, that stuff be on the internet. You know what I'm saying? So be careful uh, what you take photos of and, and, and keep your rights with your material. If you got something like that somebody might be interested in, shoot you some movies. Shoot you some, I call them movies. Shoot you some videos. Shoot you some footage. Somebody out there going to see that product. You understand what I'm saying? Or they might like how you talk, like how you speak, like how you demonstrate or illustrate, you know, or conversate, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> In reference to the thing that you do. So, you know, everybody got, you got your, your blessing is soon to come. So keep up the good work. Stay positive. You know, RC for life. You hear what I'm saying? All right. This is your boy, Mr. H-T-E. Hand tune engines and we're... Over and out. I thank y'all once again for stopping by, checking me out, man. And um, HTE on the rise. Thank you.